Hey, good morning. Uh, we're talking high knees today, so I'm going to give you a couple quick little modifications for my mod babies. So first of all, traditional high knees, hands are about high, uh, waist high, and you're going to bring your knees up. Now normally it's a running thing where you're doing this. Sorry about the microphone. Okay, another modification for those of you who are healthy and in good shape. If you don't want to do the jumping because of low back issues, you can take your hands up high and you can do one of these. Okay? So this is another one. When you're walking, I swing arms too so you get some upper, but you can just go slower like this. Okay? And I have a walking video on my YouTube channel, Cynthia Dales with the space. You can go there and there's a walking video that I did for some youth. Now, I'm going to show you a couple modifications sitting. The first one will be not sitting, but you can take a chair like this. And when you do your, you could do knees, you could just go up like this with support. Okay, go at your own comfort level. If you can't go that high, even just a little bit like this. Okay, another modification that you can do, and hopefully you can see what I'm doing, is left knee or right knee over to your left. So you can go up like this a little bit this way. You're going to get a little bit more of your obliques. You're going to get a little twist in your back. Do it at your comfort level, okay? So just a little bit up here, a little bit up here, or you can go higher like this. Okay, so for people who have bad knees, and I'm sympathized with you, I tore my MCL last year. So sit in a chair, okay? A couple different things you can do is just do them from here. Put your hands up here and go up, just as high as you can go, okay? Make sure you're seated back in your chair so you have back support if you have back issues and just go as high as you can go. The other thing you can do is they have these wonderful bands in varying strengths. If you wanna try something a little bit different, if you have any of these lying around, these are awesome. But you can put a band around your knees and do that so you get a little bit more resistance if you're there. Another one you can do, I've done with some of my clients, is put them around your feet like this. And then different bands have various strengths so it gives you more resistance, but even just a little bit like this. Okay, um, one other thing, if you just can't, you've got damage here, you just can't, would be to do um, a side shuffle or monster walks. So let me show you those. So side shuffle is exactly what it is. That's also in my video. You're on your side. If you squat a little bit, okay, and you're just going to keep your hips and your feet pointed forward, and you're going to go side to side. Let me show you the front view now. Here, I'll come up a little bit closer. Let me show you. So you're just going side, and you can do these in place, okay? Now, if you can go lower, go lower. Keep your back as, you know, neutral, chest up feet forward as you're doing them like this now monster walks are a little bit different and again they're going to incorporate a lot of muscles here so basically what you're doing is you're going in and out you'll feel that here in your low back in your legs but again this is another one I actually did a lot of these in physical therapy and that they had me doing those for my knee thighs everywhere so anyway if you have any questions DM me um, but these are all modifications that you can make. Um, again, and I have a video, a walking video that I did for some youth up on my YouTube channel. Have a great day and get your, make sure you have your water with you when you're walking. Take care.